This is Mark Peel from Campanile Restaurant here in La Brea. Uh, we've been here about 18 years. Uh, we are a Hollywood restaurant. The people who come here really are the people who make the films, make the TV shows. The writers, the agents, the, the directors, the art directors, the cinematographers, the costume designers, the set designers. So those, those are the people that I love. Writer Strike, we have come up with something called the Writer Soup Kitchen. And it's three courses a soup, choice of two soups, of course, one of which is vegetarian, a choice of three main courses a poultry, a meat, a fish, and a vegetarian, a couple scoops of ice cream, and a biscotti for 18 bucks. For us, it's about the community coming together. Uh, communicating, uh, showing solidarity, and enjoying themselves. After a long day on the picket lines, they sit down and talk, which is what they do best. Every project begins with a word, begins with an idea. Everything begins with a writer. Even if there are no words spoken, somebody has to have an idea and write it down. A strike always has a ripple effect, no matter what industry or who it is. And in this case, the, if there's no, there are no productions, there's no need for costumes, there's no need for sets, there's no need for makeup, there's no need for props, there's no need for insurance on a product production that's not going forward. So the ripple effect is huge. Um, and there's no need to go out to a restaurant to a meeting if there's nothing to meet about. No, I could tell that the soup kitchen had an effect that because at Camp Vanilla there was starting to be a, a different looking clientele. Coming through the door were all these people with glasses and a little bit of a dorky look. <laughs> I'm very thankful that Campanile is doing this because uh, this this is reserved for special occasions for Lindsay and I, and it's only about a block from where we live, so we pass it all the time. And now we actually get to go and make use of it. And uh, the menu looks really good, so uh, I'm excited to be here. Right. Glad that glad that there's restaurants who appreciate the loyalty of writers. Um, I've written soaps. I've written. Um, uh, I've won an Emmy for a children's television program. Um, I've written sitcom news. I've written sitcom, but I'm also a playwright. But um, one hour, put one it, hour. But, you know, our film stuff is on strike. I'm not gonna work on my place. I, I grew up in Los Angeles. Um, I, I've been to weddings here. I've been to rehearsal dinners here. Uh, I've had a birthday dinner here. The most impressive thing about the whole strike goes like back to when we went to that meeting at the convention center. And it was moving because you felt community outside yourself. You sit there with 3,000 writers um, in, in a meeting where the tone was not fire and brimstone, but was like reason, somber, sober. I think we all came out of the meeting feeling like, okay, we understand why we're striking now, or why we will strike, and then when we did announce the strike, none of us were like, yay, we're striking, but we did feel like, okay, there are real reasons for this, and we understand those reasons, and we support those reasons. Seeing at the, the rally, watching these SEIU members, the farm workers, watching the nurses, seeing all these unions come out was incredibly moving, and I think that whatever happens with our strike, I mean, we a bunch of us talk about this, but we won't forget that, and it's about being there for them when they're next in their kind of, when, when their next negotiations are up. We're hoping to bring people together here, at least on this one night, um, for some enjoyment. Not because it's going to make us any money, because it isn't. What it's going to do is just get people out of their out of their homes and maybe out of their funk and give them a good time. Here's grilled apple pork tuna with long cooked greens and a leek fondue, and this is a poulet frit, French. It's fri it's grilled chicken with fries and a little watercress salad. Great. It's a splash with a little bit of butter and shallots and lemon juice and uh, parsley. Great. Sounds That's good. it. That's dinner. Thank you.